Angels. So we got Love Bomb for your first card. And then we have Moves Up and Down. So Leo, I feel like you are currently being um, Love Bombed by somebody. And some of you guys could be feeling like you don't know exactly how you really feel about this person. Maybe one minute you feel like you're sure about how you feel about this person or um, it is that way or it could just be you may be a bit confused about how you feel about this person. If not, um, I'm just getting this energy where it's either they could be, you could be confused about how you feel about them or how you, you know, whether you love this person or not, or whether they're serious or not. And them, on the other hand, it could be um, them giving you red flags. Because I am getting that energy also. So, And that could be the reason why, Leo, that you may have mixed feelings about this person. Because maybe this person is always moody. Even though this person do show you some love or whatever, you know, and attention, it's like, but they have an attitude. You know what I'm saying? Maybe it's the way they say things or the way that they go about things. You know, if they bring some form of aggression, I'm getting this aggressive or complaining type energy about, you know, about the way they do things or the way that you do things, or it could be something like that. Y'all take what applies, but we got the Ace of Pentacles, Leo, and we got the Hierophant right here reversed. So this is somebody that you definitely do, you, you could be dating right now. Some of y'all, this person wants you to move in with them, because I'm getting this energy like... Somebody may have love bombed you to the point where they have moved in. I'm getting this energy where it happened so fast, Leo. Some of y'all, this person, it's either that they did already move in or they could be asking you to move in, Leo. That's the energy that I'm really picking up on. But I am seeing that you dealing with this person, I feel like things do seem real. Things do seem solid in your relationship because they are providing. They are giving. They are, like I said, whether this is love, whether this is attention, whatever it is that... You know, your person may think that you want or need. I feel like your person is giving it to you. But like I said, in the back of your mind, Leo, some of y'all could be a bit hesitant about continue on to move things forward with this person because you just feel like this person could be bringing some form of confusion. Because somebody is somebody's not ready to commit. I don't know why I'm getting that energy. It's either that somebody is not ready to commit or it's like, Okay, I'm getting two stories, Leo. That's why I'm a bit confused. So, I'm seeing this energy where, Leo, y'all may have let this person move in, right? You know, things are really good in y'all relationship, and then it got to the point where this person moved in with you. But the only reason why things could be off now is because some of y'all, this person may have been cheating on you. Maybe they stepped outside of y'all relationship with the higher fit right here reversed. I'm getting that for some of y'all. Now, the rest of y'all, it could just be that somebody asked to move in, but you could be saying that you're not ready to have a commitment. Like, you're not ready to... I feel like for the most part, Leo, there is somebody that is love bombing you and act like they want something solid with you, but at the same time, they don't want a commitment. That's what I'm, I'm feeling like. It's either that or y'all already living together and they stepped outside of y'all relationship or they may have um, checked out of the relationship and said they're not, they're not, they can't do it no more. Like I said, y'all take with applause, but I'm seeing like, to be honest, I'm seeing like three different messages with these four cards, Leo. So it can resonate for different groups of people. But I am currently getting this energy where things were solid until things were not solid. You see what I'm saying? Because somebody didn't want to commit. Somebody didn't want to stay in this relationship or they didn't want to commit. Even though they were showing this person love, attention, and it was giving to this person. It's like they did all of that just to say that they wasn't, they didn't want to commit. And I feel like some of y'all getting this energy was like, as soon as you may have caught feelings for this person, then this person may have pulled away from you and may have told you that they wasn't ready for a commitment. Because like I said, your person may have love bombed you, Leo. And it's like, as soon as they realize how, as soon as they, 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 they realize that you have feelings for them, they completely like told you like, I'm not ready to commit. I can't do this. Or even if y'all was already in a relationship with this person, Leo, your person called off, the, off of that relationship. They bailed out on that relationship, Leo. So it was one or the other. They either bailed out of the relationship or they told you that they couldn't be in a relationship. Either way, somebody didn't want to be in a relationship, even though they love bomb the heck out of somebody. I'm strongly getting that energy, Leo. We got conflict and defeat right here, but it's reversed. So it's like... Somebody low-key could be conflicted about it. 
I feel like the person that was love bombed is low key conflicted about it. Even though they're getting off this energy that they don't care and they unbothered about it, I feel like low key underneath it all, they really is like bothered about it. And it could be you, Leo. Maybe you are bo bothered by the simple fact that this person, you know, didn't want a commitment with you or they, or they bailed out of a relationship. I am getting that energy for somebody out there. But it's like the reason why you may not have said anything is because. You didn't want to argue. You didn't want no no beef with this person. You didn't want no conflict with this person, and that's why you 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 gave off the impression like you was okay with the simple fact that this person didn't want a relationship because, like deep down inside, you was really toe up about it. You see what I'm saying? And you didn't want you didn't want to argue, you know, about why this person didn't want to be with you or something like that. You know, like I said, take what applies. But we got the high priestess. Reverse for this for your first card, and then we got the ace of wands right here reverse and then we got The eight of cups, so it's like Yeah, it's like I'm getting this energy where somebody may have Went against themselves like Leo you are basically the high priestess, but it's coming to reverse So I just feel like y'all may have at one point in time went against yourself about this person You know, it's like but this person their true colors is coming out. It, it's saying that y'all avoided y'all intuition about, you know, who this person really is, Leo. You see what I'm saying? That's the energy that I'm picking up on. But we're going to see what else we got for for Leo Collective. Yeah, I just felt like a lot of you guys went against yourselves. You know, you basically misjudged the whole situation. Yeah, they may have been giving off the impression like they, you know, they want something serious with you, you know, but... Your person was playing for real. That's exactly what they're saying. This person, which they love bombed you. That's exactly what they keep saying, you know. They love bombed you. And it's sad because, like I said, some of y'all may have felt, had developed these feelings for this person. And this person knew that. And they turned around and said that they couldn't be with you. Yeah. Then I say saying, saying the same thing. You went against your intuition. But I am seeing that. I feel like you feel really, really fast, Leo. Like, literally fast for this person. Some of y'all actually did have sex with this person too soon. I am getting that energy. So, not only that you developed these feelings so fast with this person, you also slept with this person too soon, Leo. And that made this person pull away. We got the Ace of Wands reversed. And it's crazy because, like I said, your person really didn't have any intentions on actually staying in a commitment with you anyways. This is somebody that love bombs you, that gave you what, you, what it is that you wanted, and told you what it is that what you wanted to hear and it's like soon as they realize they had you emotionally bang they dropped a bomb on you where they said that they couldn't commit or they feel like they they wasn't the committal type person but like i said they was giving off that impression like they wanted something serious but they dropped that bomb i keep hearing they dropped the bomb on you and it, it really i feel like it really upsets you because you know you already told yourself that this wasn't something was off about this person but you went against your intuition you was moving too fast leo you was moving way too fast with this person. And it's like once the person got what they wanted, which is sexually, they was up out of there with this Ace of Wands reverse. We got the High Priestess. Wow. Twice. Double High Priestess reverse twice. So all the red flags was there, Leo. I'm getting that energy. Uh, all the red flags was there the whole time about this person. You even knew that you was not supposed to sleep with this person. Spirit is saying. Because maybe you had a, like your... Yo, intuition kept telling you, pulling on you, telling you, like, don't sleep with this person too soon. You know, they may not be the one, blase, blase. Whatever it is that your mind, whatever it is that you had going on in your mind, Leo, I feel like you went against your intuition. You went against whatever it is that you already thought of about this person, Leo. But this is like double confirmation right here with the high priestess reverse twice saying, listen, you knew that you wasn't supposed to sleep with this person, Leo. You knew that you, some of y'all really wasn't even attracted to this person. I'm going to keep it real with you. Some of y'all was not even physically attracted to this person. And you turned around, allowed this person to love bomb you and um and and get what they want and get up out of there. That's the energy that I'm picking up on. Now, this energy can be vice versa. But it's like, after you've seen this person for who they really is, Leo, it's like this person walked away from you. Eight of Cups. They walked away. They, they couldn't give you what she was looking for, Leo. This person ain't even happy with themselves. They could not give you what you was looking for. We got justice. Wow. Some of y'all, this person could be married. I wanted to say that, too. I've been wanting to say that at the beginning, but I was waiting for something to come out. Some of y'all, this person was married to somebody else. And that was another reason why they couldn't commit to you, Leo, because they was already in another situation behind the scenes anyway that they was already given to. 
that's the energy that I'm picking up on. But just know that even though this person did what they did to you and walked away from you, or you feel like you had to walk away from this person, they will get karma for that. The, scale, the scales would definitely be balanced with this person. I'm seeing a lot of water. Some of y'all dealing with like a Pisces or maybe a Taurus or a um or a Libra. Or you could have Pisces, Taurus, or Libra in your astrology chart, like your Venus or your Moon or Rising or something like that, Leo. Or it could be the other way around. But this is exactly what happened, Leo. This person love bombed you. This person love bombed you, made it seem like they wanted something serious with you. And then when they found out that they had you um emotionally they told you that they could commit to you or they didn't want to be with you. And it's crazy because, like I said, Leo, a lot of you guys went against yourself, man. Y'all shouldn't have did that. Y'all went, especially if you're the type of person that don't want to be, I mean, that wants something serious with somebody. You knew in your heart, your intuition kept telling you not to sleep with this person, not to um, allow this, not to let this person move so fast. Because that was a red flag itself, Leo. They was moving too fast. That's what it's saying. And then they turned around and wanted to have sex with you. This is saying both ways. Like, it was moving too fast. That was the first red flag. And then the second red flag was them trying to want to have sex with you, with you, knowing dang well, Leo, that you was not physically attracted to this person anyways. You know what I'm saying? And it's sad because, like I said, y'all wasn't even really attracted to this person. Y'all was not attracted to this person. This certain person that turned around and did what they did to you. But just know that they will get karma for what for them walking away and leading you on. That's exactly what happened because they lead you on. They drop that bomb on you. Soon as they realize they had you, in, you had they had you where you they, where they needed you emotionally. They allowed you to they 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 walked away from you. They got what they want. Walk on emotional withdrawal reverse. Yeah, this person could be avoiding you right now, Leo. This person definitely could be avoiding you, or this could be your energy where you will um where you could be isolating yourself from this person because maybe you just feel bad about you know going against yourself. But I am seeing that eventually this person is getting ready to they're gonna eventually contact you, Leo. Even though they told you that they couldn't commit to you or they bailed out a relationship if y'all was already in one, I feel like they're gonna eventually pop back up, Leo, after you've been isolated from this person for so long. You see what I'm saying? But we're going to definitely clarify. We're going to clarify, Leo. We got expectation reverse. So y'all not going to see it coming, Leo. Y'all, this is, um, be careful. Because some of y'all's person got a baby on the way. Low key, like behind the scenes. This person has a child on the way behind the scenes. I'm hearing that for somebody out there. What else, Spirit? This is something that you don't know about. Even though this person come in and, co and have a conversation with you, Leo, after you not hearing from them for a minute, um, I'm hearing five to eight. So maybe you haven't heard from this person between five to eight weeks or five to eight months, Leo, because we do got this five and then we got this eight. But um, the eight stand out the most. So five, um, eight week, eight weeks, eight months, or um. Some of y'all, this person gonna come around in August, cause eights do stand out. Whether it's this August fifth, August seventh, I'm seeing August second, August fifth, or August eighth, or your birthday could be August second, August fifth, or August eighth for some of y'all. Somebody could have been born in eighty five or maybe eighty two. I am getting that energy also. Or somebody could be twenty eight years old. Or somebody could have a ten year old. Some of y'all's person have a ten year old, or maybe you have a ten year old. What else do we have? These numbers, these five and these eight stand out so much, y'all. I'm telling y'all, some of y'all are going to see this person August 5th or August um 8th. I'm getting the chills. I swear I am. Somebody, this person going to pop up in August. Or August 2nd. Didn't I say that? This person going to try to come in and, and change some things up. This person... Had to make, it's going to make some form of a decision, Leo. Wow. We got the nine of pentacles right here reverse, but it's still saying that your person is still in a relationship. Even though this person comes back up, pop up out of nowhere, Leo, and trying to make some form of a change between y'all, your person is, is secretly in another relationship, Leo. Code, this person is codependent to somebody else for real. Some of y'all's person may come in and say they want to be in a relationship with you. It's, it may be the other way around, you know, but it's either that they may be in another relationship behind the scenes, Leo, or they could be telling you that they want to be in a relationship with you. Um, or it could be both, but 
I'm gonna clarify. I'm gonna clarify because there's different scenarios for different people. What else do we have? Very clear. That's too many cards. Come on, spirit. We just want one card. It stands out. I'm gonna take it. Yeah, it's saying that they want to be with you because they. It's because they walked away from somebody or somebody walked away from them. But this person has no self-respect whatsoever for themselves. This person's still messing around with other people. Clearly, it's clearly saying that. It's whether that they have somebody else behind the scenes and they could be coming off like they want to be with you and they, they left somebody else or something like that. Or it could be, either way, this person is still messing around. This is somebody that don't even have respect for you or themselves. The King of Wands reverse. Some of y'all's person may not have no job. And they could be wanting to depend on you, um, Leo, because whatever they had behind the scenes didn't go right. So they could be coming back to you to be dependent on you, Leo. But this is somebody you basically, that basically don't respect you. I'm going to keep it real with y'all. They don't respect you. And it's crazy because we got the five of wands right here reversed. This person, it's like they're trying to avoid, this is somebody who avoid accountability also. So y'all be careful with this energy, Leo. This is what I got for you guys.